So let's try and understand. What is the government saying? What is the opposition saying? It's about celebrating the Siranga, but there are political daggers that are out. There's politics over our tricolor, ladies and gentlemen. The opposition says, why should we accept BJP's political agenda? Wo apna jhanda lagayenge, hum apna jhanda lagayenge. The government stand, it's not a party program, it is an event for India. All of parliament together should have been part of it. The opposition is saying Tiranga is being used as a political tool. They are saying Rashtraniti is above Rajniti. That's what the government's position is. And then, the government here is saying, flag of Parivar Tantra is now becoming bigger than Lok Tantra. But then here comes the jaip. RSS didn't unfurl the Tiranga at Nagpur for 52 years. Is waving the flag equal to patriotism? Janda le raunga, tabhi desh bhaktu. That's the question that's being asked. Time to set aside ideology for the pride of Bharat, not off, for the pride of Bharat, ladies and gentlemen. That's the point of view. They are saying, Kisne kab janda le raya, nahi le raya is not the point. Aaj kya point hai? What do you believe in our 75th year? Does this tricolor matter to you? Are you committed to the tricolor? Are you putting the nation first and the tricolor first? And is not the flag the symbol, the foremost symbol of nationhood, to instill nationhood. Let's dive into the debate. Why choose ideology over Bharat is a question that we are asking. I have Sujada Paul, leader of the Congress Party, SP Vaid, former DGP of Jammu and Kashmir with us, and Sanju Verma, national spokesperson of the BJP, also should be joining us. Let me start with Mr. SP Vaid. When somebody says, he apna jhande ki party kar rahe hain, hum hamare jhande ki kar lenge. What does this make you feel, sir? See, as a soldier, I feel insulted because uh, uh, for us, Chanda is one spirit of India. Uh, and uh, our Jawans die for this flag. And uh, uh, this is one uh, Indian national flag, uh, irrespective of the caste, color, creed our region you belong uh, the jawan does not say i am a tamilian or i am a mizoram uh, i am hmm. a kashmiri i am a muslim or hindu uh, i think political parties need to learn from uh, these jawans who lay down their life for uh, these uh, national hmm. monuments like uh, national flag hmm. and um, you may have different uh, programs you may have different uh, ideologies you may have different uh, programs for the people, the, the, your policies, but nation is one. After all, nation, uh, the national flag represents the nation, and if nation remains only, then you we all have our existence, and flag represents that spirit of one India. Hmm. And I think uh, political parties need to take cue from the security uh, security forces, their jawans. Uh, we we have no doubt about their commitment to the country, but. In the process of criticizing each other, they forget that they are ultimately damaging the country. But let me ask you, Mr. Ved, is it necessary that only families where uh, uh, they are from uniform, that they hail from any form of uniform, only they should know what the Tiranga means? If that is no. the case, then then sare uh, politicians say, Jabardasti National Service, karai hai, sir, ek saar. No, no, no. Politicians have uh, rather uh, much more... Uh, role in this country they are the leaders they lead the future generations and we all uh, draw a lot of inspiration from political leaders unfortunately what is happening is that uh, you are trying to, uh, the, the the blurred line between the na national identity and the political identity is getting actually getting blurred so that that uh, hmm. You, the, 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 we need to distinguish between what is what is my nation and what is in in the interest of my country. Hmm. What is my country's uh, uh, future course? What is uh, my country trying to achieve together as everyone, all Indians together? Hmm. That is one one spirit. But you may have different programs as political parties. You may have different programs for uh, different. Uh, hmm ideologies but uh, i think as one nation we are all together we are all one indian nation mm. and uh, this i think we all should be one and uh, political parties have a great role to play and mm. rather we all uh, look towards them so uh, 
my 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 humble request is a civilian is a a, a soldier in in civil dress yeah. in this country and he must he has as much uh, respect and role for the national flag as any soldier has sujatha paul mr ved with all due respect i think you should keep your advice for yourself and not give dole out advice to every political party because today it is the entire opposition that we are talking about and why is it that the entire opposition has not been taken on board by the government in spite of their invitations the reason is there is a trust deficit and this is a democracy and we want this democracy to remain thriving and that is the reason why such a situation has come but you will not tell who to celebrate the tiranga and how my tiranga my pride that is something that that remains the common thing common factor for everyone across the country and if somebody is celebrating it in a particular way and is not going with the government you can't question their feelings about the tiranga you want the country to follow one party also because today it is the bjp party which is not only leading the country but it is a it is given our government which is not been able to be the party uh, which is giving a government to everybody irrespective of which party which ideology which religion which community they come from and that is the reason for it so that must be questioned as well the feeling of patriotism cannot be questioned whether a particular person belongs to the ruling party or somebody else it is the government's responsibility to mm. get everybody together they have failed in doing so but please do not question my feeling for my tiranga like i would not like to question yours miss mm. uh, sujatha paul you're well, you're most welcome to make your argument and despite despite your deference or uh, to uh, to mr sp where the way you started i take objection to that ma'am and i request you to please please uh, you you can use whatever political uh, jibes at the political opponent uh, that is mr sanju verma but to speak in that tone with mr sp where was perhaps uh, not uh, perhaps a little beneath you and it was not expected from you but your arguments well taken well considered we may agree disagree with that argument here the simple